Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Today's wisdom will be coming from 1 Peter, 1 Peter chapter number 5, verse number 8. That's 1 Peter chapter 5, verse 8. It says, be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, walking about seeking whom he may devour. Today I want to talk about be sober or get pulled over. Be sober or get pulled over. Of course, um, in our Bible class table talk, we've been dealing with journey into triumphant living. And we've discovered that triumphant is something we do not for victory, but for, from victory. And of course, over 2,000 years ago, uh, Jesus Christ, through his death, burial, and resurrection, he had triumphed over the enemy. And when we as believers place our faith in him, he calls us to be victorious. We are overcomers. We are more than a conqueror. He calls us to triumph and make manifest his saving knowledge in every place. But if we're going to maintain what he has given us, uh, Peter concludes, he says in verse number eight, we got to know that we have a roaring adversary. Verse number nine, he says, we have to have the right action. And then verse 10 through 14, he says, we have to have the right after that. He says, listen, in verse number eight, there are three particular points. He says, we have to, number one, respect the enemy. Number two, we have to recognize him. And number three, we have to resist him. He says, be sober. We have to make sure that we are not spiritually intoxicated or, or, or out of control where we allow the devil to take control and cause us to crash or cause us to uh bring home to ourselves and to others. He said we have to be sober. Uh, we have to respect him. And then number two, we have to be uh, be vigilant. He says we have to be alert. Too many of us are, are spiritually dead that we don't recognize Satan when he comes through the lust of the flesh and through the lust of the eye. Satan, of course, is the uh, uh, accuser. He, he is the adversary and the devil. He is the accuser of the brother. He comes to us as a, as a, as a, as a serpent to deceive us and as a lion. He comes to devour us. But of course, if we're going to do it, he coming to walk, he's walking and seeking whom he may devour. We have to get to the place where we resist him. Psalm 4 and 7 says, resist the devil and submit to God, resist the devil and he flee, He shall flee from us. We got to submit to God first. Of course, if we are going to be able to stand and withstand the, devil, the enemy, the onslaught of the devil, we have to make sure we bow down before our God. Listen, join us tonight for our Bible class table talk on our Facebook Live and Zoom teleconference at 715 as we deal with this topic, be sober or get pulled over as we conclude with journey into triumph and living. I pray that the word of God has blessed you on today. As always, today will be better than yesterday. Tomorrow will be better than today. Why I was trying to live better, be better and do better. I am happy, I am healthy and I am holy. Be sober or get pulled over.